uh, well, in a, in a minute. Let's just to explain why it's very easy to play with nine seconds. Yeah. <laughs> yeah five, five moves, yeah. I mean, okay. That's good. For you, it's no problem, you know. Well, but the point uh, is it's pretty obvious what White's doing. Yeah, I mean, Levon played rook f5 right. Yeah, away. but why did he? Why did he exchange? All, he played rook f7, you know, exchanging off pieces. Just, I just thought uh, it was very messy. I didn't see exactly yeah, no, what no, happened. Yeah, no, no, it was it was very very messy. But, so. No, he'll make time control. I think. I mean, how can he not? I mean, just rook c. <laughs> no, because I mean, the thing is, you go rook c5 and then you move your king or knight. So you go rook c4 now. Ah, rook c4, good move. Yeah. Ah, very good move, very good move. Yeah. Ah, still, still have some class. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you. Thank you. Grandpa <laughs> Chess. <That's, laughs> you you're welcome back. I had Vladimir Kramnik saying I'm playing Grandpa Chess <laughs> <laughs> yesterday. You're welcome back here. <laughs> nah, no, rook c4 is, is a very good move, actually. Yeah, yeah very, yeah. very good move. I didn't yeah. see that. Yeah, I mean, but... The thing is, can black really create any threats well, immediately? Just, yeah. I just mean, because rook c4, I'm going you're king g3 instantly. And then, and then c5, b4. And then I'm going yeah. king f4, king f3 right away, too. Yeah. But yeah, actually, yeah. no, if you get c5, b4, probably take six, knight d5, some a5. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's, it should, should, should be, should be, yeah. uh, should be holding, but yeah, yeah actually. But you see, this was a, this was a very strange choice. When the guy's got seconds left, mm -hmm. why do you play rook f7, I don't know, um, C well, for c5 or something, you know, just... Yeah, but you know, it's Ani, she has to be precise, that's <laughs> kind of the point. No, probably saw c5, knight e2, rook d2, rook f6 or something like this, and he... Ah, but then rook g6... Rook g6. No, yeah, because no, no, knight no, f4, no, king no, g5, no, 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 I mean... Yeah. Actually, that's, that's quite, quite good. No, you're right, actually. From a practical standpoint, to, to trade the rooks doesn't when, make when a lot of sense. When the guy's got seconds. Yeah. The guy's got seconds. I mean... Okay, but it's, it's on niche. You know, he has to be precise. <laughs> I mean, you can't give any counterplay. I mean, he has to be precise. So that's why he did that. But, I, of course, yeah, I, I, don't, yeah. I, don't, I don't like the decision yeah. uh, when you consider the time. Because, um, yeah, actually, just C5, yeah. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense. But, but like I said, I mean, you see some counterplay, you get a little bit scared. I mean, yeah, he's so... Okay, so he played rook C4, king G3. No, bishop g6, rook d5 should should be holding, so. Mm -hmm. Is there any sort of trick here? Maybe c6? c6 is actually what this thing is suggesting. c6, a5, yeah. and b4. Yeah, which c6 is, is uh, probably the, uh, the best uh, chance. I mean, uh, but white should be okay, but still some... Yeah, still actually with like seven seconds, yeah, if, if black plays c6, yeah, I mean... No. Okay, I mean, if Levon is actually calculating very well, he'll, he'll be fine, but I mean... Yeah. To calculate really well in this position when I, well, okay. Yeah. It's the simplest move, c5. It's yeah. uh, no, the thing is, c6 creates that trick because you're threatening king f4, you go bishop g6, rook e5, king f6, or something something really weird like that. And I, I don't know if white's. Dominate. Dominate yeah, I don't know if white's rook is getting trapped somehow. Not trapped, yeah. but yeah, dominated, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, it's. Uh, but, I mean, I. No, I mean I think he'll he'll make move forward. If he makes move forward, he'll yeah. he'll hold. Okay, the moment yeah. the moment uh, he reaches move forty, we will come straight onto your very interesting game. Uh -huh. um, but uh, we'll just see if he makes it. It looks highly likely. The worst okay. is over. Only two yeah, moves I, to make. I, I, don't, I don't see how he doesn't make it. Um, I think it might just be a drive and it move forty, pretty much. Uh, yeah. Knight a4 or knight d5. Ah, yeah, because a5 you have knight e3, right? Right. Yeah, but b3? Yeah, b3 is possible. b3? Some tricks. But it's move 40. So Anish has. B3, knight e3. Yeah, knight e3 yeah, should, should be holding. Long. Yeah. Yeah, knight e3 is, is a very But I mean, still, knight e3, rook d4. Still, or probably rook a five, rook d two, knight f five, or something. Yeah, it should should be holding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, we just. I mean, uh, he, might even, he, he might even just take the knight. Actually, <laughs> yeah. If we know, if we if we know, Anish. I mean, he's got uh, forty something uh, seconds. Oh, but they made move forty, yeah. Well, that's forty for white. For white, okay. Yeah. yeah. So he's got. Uh, we'll just see this. We got half a minute, maximum. 
and he's having a think. Levon has probably gone to the bathroom, if he's got any sense. <laughs> he's played B3. Okay. okay. So a more tricky, yeah. more tricky move. Okay, well, shall thanks. I, shall I try to get Magnus? Or yeah, well, if you, you can, if you, start. If, you, if you can find him, but yep. we, 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 we will, uh, we will yep. kick, kick off. Um, so, uh, great. Um, run us through the game. Sure, Hikari. yeah. Okay, so, um, yeah, so I played the Nidorf like uh, the last time in Bilbao. Um, but, I mean, the thing is, last time um, Magnus played a uh, slightly different order. He, he played um, he played it like this. I think he played... I think he played... I think I think this is how the game went, something like this. So so we, last time we played, ended up playing a, uh, a G3 Nidorf via right. this other order. Right, um, okay. But I think perhaps, actually, Magnus uh, didn't realize that at the time... When he played G3, I was planning to play G6 anyway. Yes. Because we ended up transposing. After G3, this this turns into um, a, a G3 Knight Orb. Yeah. A uh, di different order, of course, but it just uh, all transposes. So I'd looked at this. Um, yeah, so I'd looked so at a few I moves mean, here. Knight D7, you shouldn't move the same piece twice in the, the opening. Is it, are you happy with that move? Just, uh, it's the best <laughs> move. It's the best move. At least from what I saw, it's the best move. Um, right. Yeah. I mean, because basically the idea is simple. I just want to exchange and go b6, bishop b7, almost no matter what white does here. Um, right. Like, if, if white plays queen felt, d2, I do the same thing. It felt like you were a little bit worse in the game. Worse. You, don't, I thought, yeah, I thought you, don't, I, you thought you were better. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Oh, yeah. Well, okay. okay. Well, I mean, we'll see. Some, yeah. Someone was better. I, I think yeah. that much is clear. Um, yeah, somewhere around here, um, yeah, there were a lot of uh, options here. Like, I wasn't really sh I, I could have played it like this in A5, and I wasn't really sure what's going on. Um, this was one way I could have played where it's yeah. very interesting, I think. So, so a rook to the Which C, rook? well, probably the A rook. Yeah, because if you, if you go this way, then I have this A4 trick, yeah. A3, A4, because yeah. yeah. it's this. Yeah. But, um, yeah, but if you play rook AC1... Even knight c5 here? Yeah, a3 is and forced. And a4? Yeah, b4 I have to knight play. And okay, so I, I have I mean, to go I, 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 I have either. to go in. I have to go Where? in. c6. Knight d4? Knight d4, and I have to play rook c1 or something like that. You. But I mean, is this really supposed to be that dangerous? Takes. b5. And you're ah, going to here you have bishop, 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 bishop f1, f1. Yeah. queen b8. Yeah, I mean, maybe this is too queen, much. Queen but B D three. But yeah. I mean, okay, here I I don't even have to do that. Let's just say I ignore it and play B five. That is probably much wiser. <laughs> I mean, it's just I wasn't yeah. really sure yeah. what was going on. Like yeah. I had this one, but yeah, yeah, I, it was very interesting. And then after B five, um, rook A C one. Yeah, there were a few. What what was I considering here? Um, yeah, takes. I was also considering uh, A five here. This is also I think quite interesting. Um, but yeah, I wasn't so really so sure what's going rook on. Rook well, no, if rook c1, then I'm happy, because then I get a better better version, I think, right? Or is it just going to transpose? Same, well, it's the same, isn't it? Oh, isn't so it's irrelevant. It? Yeah. Ah, it's, it's just totally irrelevant. Okay, never yeah, mind. Okay. Sorry. Yeah, but I was actually, I was thinking that here, white could also maybe play knight c7. This is what I wasn't sure about. Uh-huh. So if I go rook c8, then there's rook fc1, and knight c5 doesn't work, so knight b5. Mm -hmm. And knight d6 next. And knight d6. Um, uh, bishop, uh, ah, yes, that. Yeah, bishop this is ninety six exactly, and knight takes c eight. Yeah, okay. doesn't doesn't matter. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, like it was, like, yeah. So I mean, I, I wasn't sure about that, so I just figured I should just take right away a five. And here is another big question. I don't have to play uh, knight c five here, um, but but I did. So a three f five b four takes takes. Yeah, and here, I mean, f4 doesn't doesn't quite work, because white just takes and goes queen f3. Yeah. After knight d7, just rook takes f4, and it's yeah. just a pawn. Yeah, and that's a very important pawn, because it's a battering ram, isn't it? In yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, without that pawn, it's just terrible. So, I mean, yeah, like, all this, I think, is... I mean, I could have gone king h8, too, but I didn't... I thought on king h8, it's a worse version, because now I don't have queen g5. Uh-huh, right. So that's why I played rook f7. Um... Yeah, actually, I was very worried about this move, rook c7, not queen takes d6. Um, and I wasn't really sure what, what I was doing. Actually, this was the one moment when I was a little bit concerned uh, about the position, so was king, if you played rook c7. King, 
King, King Kong. G7, Queen takes D6. And I mean, this this I wasn't sure about at all. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I have Rook A2, and it's still some Queen H4 tricks. It's, it's very hard to know what's going on. Yeah. I mean, I think Black should be okay just because. The You're white, very active. You're very yeah, I'm active. very active. And even though I'm not mating White, I mean, White's king and the bishop. Not are immediately. Be able to, not immediately. No, I'm, I'm, I'm never mating with the bishop yeah. on F1. Um, yeah. Unless I get something to the back rank, but I mean, I thought this was. It was very interesting, too. Yeah. I mean, I wasn't sure what was going on, but yeah. I, I figured somehow I should have enough counterplay. But after this, queen g5, um, yeah, I thought here king h1 was definitely uh, not correct. I thought I thought maybe rook c8 first made more sense. Um, the point being, I think, takes, takes, king g7. Now on king h1, I think f3... White can at least take here. Uh -huh. I think this is a difference. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Um, right, okay. I mean, but even this, after rook f3, maybe I still have enough counterplay to, to draw this. Maybe. I'm not not sure. But, yeah, probably rook f3 takes and king h6. I mean, queen g queen takes d5. Queen takes d5, right. Yeah, I mean, I, I have that. So, I mean, even this, I suspect, is, is enough because white's king is so open and the pawns yep. are all split, all spread out over the board. Um so I thought that was uh, quite interesting. But after King H1... Did you get optimistic at uh, yeah, I mean, any, any point? Because yeah, I mean, because after I played Knight F6, I started to get really optimistic. So I, I, I feel like here it's already... Uh, only black can possibly be better, I think, Yeah. at this point. I, yeah. I don't see how white can be better. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, once once we reached this position, I was now like up like five five minutes on the clock, and and everything was out the increment. I started getting optimistic. Question, question I, I was mm -hmm. wondering about... Um, queen g3. Here. Yeah, I mean, they're t I think queen e6 is wrong. Uh, yeah. w that goes without saying. But I think queen g3, queen d2 is also really unclear. Oh, this is, um, this is, this is interesting. Yeah. I mean, I wasn't sure even can here you, what's can going you, can on. Can you take on f3? Yeah, you can take and I mean, for example, I have knight h5, and this should be enough to draw. Queen e, e3. Yeah, queen e3. I don't know. Rook takes f2, maybe. Or queen f2. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Okay. Okay, so rook takes f2. So I take your queen. Takes, takes. Probably you should check, I assume. Yeah, yeah if, you, if, you, if you don't check, yeah. then you're in. Yeah. King g7. Bishop c4. I mean, somehow I feel like this should this should be a draw. Maybe this isn't so simple. Um, well, you're struggling, There's aren't you? I mean, you, you, it may, yeah, may, no, may, may, is, may be, may, yeah. may be a draw, but actually, uh, but I'll, actually, here, I can also just play knight takes d5. Now that I think about it, mm -hmm. yeah, actually, sorry, this this is what I saw it was knight takes d5. Yeah, because what what does white do here? Yeah, I thought this was just a simple draw. Yeah, yeah. Because okay. I mean, worst case scenario is when like queen g3, I can even play knight takes b4. I think. Mm -hmm. And I mean, okay, there's yeah, there, sure, it's, it, sure. You're not going to get bishop c4 in time, so. Um, it, I, I mean, I, I saw I saw this, and I figured this has to be a uh, holding. Yes. Um, but queen e6 is definitely wrong because now after king g7, um, I mean, white white has to be very precise. Like um, rook c8, for example, I think was not correct. Uh, yeah, because here I can take a rook a2. I saw something here. Is it takes? Okay, let's just say rook a2, for example. Um, and I don't know, white has to play something like rook c2. Maybe rook a7, even. I mean, it's, it's and getting... And you're, uh, you're basically just attacking here. and Exactly, uh, yeah. yeah white's, and white's pawns aren't, aren't going to be cleaning <laughs> anytime soon, either. Yeah. So... Yeah. Uh, yeah, exactly. Like, I, I mean, I, I figure from e a, even from if a, down a, a pawn, it doesn't matter. From a practical point of view, you're not risking... Right. Very much. Exactly, yeah. 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 yeah, that's why I felt like once Magnus allowed f3, bishop f1, I mean, he he has no chances really to be better. I mean, especially with that, with like both rooks on the board. If yes. he could have gotten something like this with one, one rook on the board and he's controlling the right squares, then it's possible. But there's, there's always a huge yeah. amount of counterplay. Yeah. And yeah, I mean, he's very lucky here not to be um, like after queen one, 94 just barely doesn't work. I mean, this is what I want to do, but unfortunately he has rook c2. Uh huh. And like, and actually, rook e8, and the, the point is he has queen d1. This is what I forgot about, because this is my original idea. But after queen d1, white's just yes. holding everything yeah. together. Yeah. Um, and, and perhaps he's... Yeah, yeah, maybe, maybe he's trying, yeah, yeah, now white's trying to play for the win yeah, again. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly, yeah. 
you know. I mean, maybe queen h4 just forces a draw somehow. Yeah. Yeah, queen h4, king g1, queen g5 or something. Something stupid. Oh, queen qu check. King, well, queen check. Queen check, king h5. Queen e3. And I have no tricks here. Uh, yeah, I have no tricks here. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, okay. okay. So that's a, that's a bit too much. Um, yeah, you, see, you started to yeah. lose the coordination <laughs> a little right, bit. Right, exactly. Here. Yeah, that's, that's why rook a2 is it. Yeah. Because this also creates this threat rook e2. This yes, is a, yes. Yeah, very important key, as well. Key, key threat, um, yeah. Yeah, I mean two threats. Rook e2 and now knight e4. That's yeah. the whole point because he doesn't have rook c2 now. Yeah. But uh, yeah, after rook e7, I mean, I played knight e4 force in the draw. Um, after the game, Magnus asked me why I didn't play knight yeah. takes d5. Um, well, that's what, yeah. But I, I didn't really feel like I should Queen be... Queen D2. Yeah, yeah. no, I mean, I, I saw this, but I, I didn't really understand why I should be better, why I should be much better here. Like, takes, like, B5, for and, example. Uh, and how is rook... No, I mean, I'll get an extra pawn. I'm not, I'm yeah. not saying... Yeah, I mean, yeah, I can yeah, go yeah, rook yeah, F2, yeah, rook yeah, D5, yeah. rook F1, and, yeah, yeah, sure. and I mean, yeah. I can... I can play two versus one, but there's yeah, really okay. no point in that. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's why I just played knight g4, just to force yes, the draw. Cause yes, it, I yes. just didn't see okay. anything great. So so yeah, so it's been, it was a very interesting game. Yeah, good. Well, thank you very much for your comments, your enlightening comments, and um, and good luck for tomorrow. Yeah. Thank Short you. break. Short break. <laughs> yeah, thanks.